Okay, we have four of cups, ace of swords, and three of wands. So, for some of you, do feel you have something or someone offer you something like new beginning, new start, fresh start, but you're not really looking forward to that. I think for many of you, you have like um, different plans. You have, or oh, someone's gonna offer you like partner, friend, or family member something that is not what you're actually planning. So it could like leave you in quite some of you, maybe tricky situation. Either um, be a good guy and accept this offer, move on with your choices made previously, or take a cut everything off, cut every, every someone loose or something and move on. Different direction. So let's see. This week I do feel first three cards is giving me um like more overall energy for all the reading. We'll see how it's gonna be for you guys. But definitely feel someone's giving making your offer uh or you accepted offer you're not happy. So either you deciding to stay in this situation because you feel like obligated to stay or for some of you I think we'll see what other cards will show feel like you deciding to cut yourself loose from the situation and move forward different direction so it could be work related as I said family relationship For some of you, you know, you might scared maybe leave that previous situation because, you know, on a paper you have everything you would like, you know, everyone would wish for. But you just don't, don't feel that that is for you, that what you, what you really want. You have Eight of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. And three of cups. Right. Hmm. For some of you, it could be your energy coming through here as a swords. For others, you might deal with another air sign, Libra Aquarius, or another Gemini. It's still very strong water energy coming through. Maybe you or your partner. Water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Always could be, remember, moon or rising signs too. And I think for many of you, you about you could take that next step. Accept someone's offer and celebrate. Work on your choices, what you already made, and celebrate. But you're not looking forward. You not look that you don't look like you want to celebrate this thing, whatever is going on in your life. Because what's weird? This is ending in three. This one is ending in three. So I think spirit and universe calls you to um, trusting your intuition. You know, to find a way to express yourself. Hmm. You definitely need to figure out what is best for you before you move to that celebratory energy. I do believe with the energies you have or possibilities right now, it might need hard work for others do you feel if it's not love related or relationship related uh, message coming through I believe you might um, get some kind of bonus at work 
and get promoted, uh, wage increase or this kind of, so you will feel self celebratory because of that. But if it's happened, it's gonna happen because it didn't happen for a very long time. You've been very looking forward that you will very working hard towards that goal. And for some of you, you know, new clients and new projects coming your way. So something to celebrate. All the cards I'm putting on, it might resonate with, it carry on with the same message. Or for some of you, it could be <coughs> different kind of messages and for different people. So um, next we have Queen of Cups. Page of Wands and Hierophant. So, yeah, I do feel, as I said, that Water Sign wants to commit to you. Want to bring that, you know, commitment, marriage or something. But you don't feel that, how to say, that spark, that something extra in in relationship on this partnership, so you could go further and higher commitment, bigger commitment. Maybe you don't feel mature enough, or maybe you think that it's just something missing. You might think is something missing. For some of you, could be dealing with a Taurus energy. So yeah, if it's you in the situation, uncertain situation, <clears throat> thinking that there's a lot of work to do, for some of you, it could be that it's just something extra missing in relationships, so you could definitely be happy to commit to this person doesn't need to be love relationship it could be any relationship <coughs> I don't think you're ready to signing um, any paperwork any contract I don't think you're ready if it's work related yes um, some kind of creative idea might come up to you or someone help you to carry on with creative ideas to achieve them, you know, um, bigger clientele, higher profile clients, uh, bigger projects or something. Well, but what I can see, we have Knight of Wands, Six of Wands and Six of Swords, guys. <coughs> Very sorry. Just let me have a drink. Is definitely moving forward energy coming now and I feel that you want to move forward either with your creative ideas or in your relationship or search for something um, you that you know Knight of Wands have this passion which dri drives you, drives gives you that Driven energy brings a driven energy to be successful, move forward, you know, achieve better. For some of you, it could be moving house uh, with the six of swords or something, maybe uh, taking mortgage and, and buying house or flat or something, some kind of property. But you getting that fire up about something so definitely something is gonna be someone or some kind of situation is gonna inspire you to move forward maybe for some of you you thought like you're never gonna commit to anyone like get married you know have children and something and you might meet someone or you just met someone and you can't think of anything else just to commit to this person. It could be some of you for that. But what I'm seeing here and what the messages are coming through is just what do you think you need to realize what you actually want in your life and then move and you will be victorious. 
either either situation you are you know you want to take a new path in relationship in a business and 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 anywhere it's just it's up to you and here you go look yes it shows that you like might feel like you're juggling two situations working home or two people usually those card mean like juggling two people and not not knowing what to choose from but what a main energy as i said first three cards suggest look ship is here ship is there here you're juggling your options here you taking what's what you want and moving forward so you're taking that idea you're taking something you know realization or something and moving forward and with the star card here and your energy here as a king of swords look you're looking at your dream you're literally looking at your dream and you know you can achieve your dream you will be successful gemini you will be you just need to move 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 stop juggling yourself stop juggling your uh, thoughts or something juggling between two things two people two two jobs or something concentrate on what really really want and move forward there you go on the bottom of the deck i have knight of cups so so for some of you <clears throat> sorry it could be relationship definitely re relationship energy coming forwards you know and you might be needed to make a choice in your love life or relationship with your friends and your family um don't work on anyone's dream dream on your work the dreams you determine you're ambitious energies are coming right for you to achieve your goals guys and you need to take it it's just like i know you gemini have been some kind of suspension time for some of you for a couple months but now i think many of you might start seeing clearly what you want what new start you want what do you want to start what you want to carry on doing you know it's a lovely energy gemini is just stop juggling it's just message is stop juggling choose one thing choose one job choose one person choose i don't know one idea to work on it and just go for it by the end of the month you will see that it was worth it an oracle card we have for you is community so let's see what the book says about it oh lost it i just saw number seven and i lost it okay so this card shows three women celebrating, sharing ideas and supportive energy. The lights in the picture represent your ever-present spirit communi community as well. When this card appears, it indicates an, <coughs> sorry, an association of some kind. It might be casual connection of like-minded people joining a club or community or some sort, or even a business partnership considering of three or more and entities the time is ripe to make such a new contact connections and to share intentions whether you're personal or professional working and common and community are important parts of the human experience and the security of sense of connection can be specific to all it's true that when several people join the inten intentions it accelerates the power in the energetic re realm Receiving this card puts you on notice that the universe is sending some beneficial allowances your way. Like the happy family card that could also indicate a party or celebration of some kind. Definitely celebratory energy, guys. Definitely. Just take what you learn from the situation. Move on. Take what serves you and move on. Um... Take all the lessons and learn them. Learn them. Because, as I said, in, you know, previously, stop juggling. Concentrate on something and move forward, guys. 
you coming into your power definitely and you will be back in your power by your birthday but is you don't need to wait for your birthday to make a choices you need to start doing now reflect on the situation and just move thank you very much guys for watching